Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. And there's Porter down town Boston's at the Carmen. Just want to show you a little activity what I seen over here. Now this is a very, very controversial. Uh, I guess you call it a monument, because it's not really a statue. Usually a statue is a of a person. So um, let's see what they have. I may ask a few people what they think about it. What, what, what do you what do you think about this? What do you think about this? Good, bad. You like it? Concept and the organization. Okay, cool. Yeah. How about you? That incorporates the wife in it. Okay, cool. What do you think? From me, my point of view is I think they should have made a full statue of the person. Mm -hmm. So, like, for yeah. someone who don't know what that means without reading it, yeah. they won't know the full meaning behind it. So, unless I physically tell you what what it is, how would you identify that? Yeah. Like, all other statues have heads, they have torsos, right. they have bodies, and they speak for themselves. So I'm a kind of a free independent person, so I kind of say what I have to say. Yeah. And I don't look at like public opinion, but I talked to a lot of people, yeah. and they didn't like it. <laughs> All right, you guys talking here. So we got the hands that's over here. Um, take a quick walk around so you can see what they have. What do you think about it? You like it? Don't like it? No, it's no English. No English? Do, do you like it? Do you like this? The, the, the statue? Uh, no? No. no. It, 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 be honest. Be honest. If you like it, say you like it. If you don't. No? It's okay. I like, I like people's independent opinion. What do you think about it? you like it? Dislike it? It's pretty good. Pretty good? Okay. I want to hear what people have to say about it. What do you think about it? I, I think it looks better in person than what I've seen in pictures. I okay. like it more. And I get, because you can walk around it and get the 3D experience. Gotcha. All right, cool. What do you think about it? Me, I think if it was going to, this is only my opinion, yeah, yeah. and other people heard it, yeah. but if they were going to represent Martin Luther King, it should have been more of a, a body like statue rather than an arm and an arm. Because a lot of people get mixed messages depending on how they look at it and where they're looking at it from. Yeah, well, if and, <laughs> I don't really see that quite myself. Well, but. yeah, this, this views, this, well, it depends on how you take hold the camera, too. But a lot of people didn't like it because they didn't have any input on the side and how it should be made, or at least have a, some input. But I talked to a lot of people, so I... I, I don't know about monuments, though. Do people get input on monuments? Well, they I mean, should. have had a public hearing? I don't know, maybe. What's that? You want you to take a picture? You want me to take a picture? Oh, take a picture of him. Oh, now, are you doing this for your own self? My own self, yeah. So he want me to take a picture. Hold on. Let me see if I can snap a picture of this real quick. Hold on. One more. Oh, okay. I did a couple of them. So you, you probably get a few out of there. So I, I, what I, do, I have a YouTube channel, so I put a lot of my stuff on YouTube. Oh. So I came down here just to get some opinion. Some people are not going to voice their opinion as much as they want to off camera than rather than on camera. Yeah, yeah. Because the, the, the opinions I got off camera are totally different than what I get on camera. Oh, of course. So I want to get m both sides. What, uh, is, what is your YouTube channel? It's called External Affairs Porter on YouTube. External Affairs Porter. On YouTube. Okay. It's, it's, you, you see it. I, I don't know what the title is going to be, but... Um, Something about the embrace statue, I'll, I'll label it that way. But, you so know, you're doing, because I saw you filming the march. I did that too. I did you're doing two different things. I, do, I did a lot of things today. So I filmed the march too, you're right. Um, that's going to be my YouTube channel as well. Okay. It's, that's going to be under um, something to do with abortion rights. Okay. Um, so I, I kind of be creative on the title, but usually it's going to be a, maybe abortion rights is, is healthcare. Healthcare, yeah, or abortion right is a human right. I'll put it maybe that. Okay. Well, so you don't you have different multiple things that you're putting. Yeah, on. a lot of different things I, I document. So this is one of many things. Actually, I did the Ukraine thing over yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. The protest for independence of yeah. Ukraine. So you see a lot of different stuff on there. Yeah. So it's not going to be one particular thing. I'm trying to broaden my platform in a in a much wider way that it's impossible. So you can see a lot of stuff on there. Well, good for you. Yeah, I'm gonna. It's lucky everything's happening on one day for you, right? Yeah, and I'm, I'm, but this is only one area. I'm, I'm, I travel throughout the city of Boston and document other stuff too. Well, good for you. Yeah, all right. What do you think about the uh, monument? Um, 
Yeah, I like that. This is my first be time. Be honest. Be it. honest. Don't <laughs> don't hold back. I don't know yet. Still determining. Okay. Yeah, I want I want honest. I want you a free opinion. I don't want you to be biased or don't feel like someone's making you say something you don't want to say. Yeah. Still determining if I if what you, I think. Okay. You got gotcha. you. Now this is the angle that a lot of people don't like to see, so this the, we're not going to show that angle too much. But um, to give you guys an idea, yeah. if, I can get, if I can do it without nobody. Um, What, 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 do you, what do you think of this monument? You like it? Dislike it? I think it's beautiful. I think it's beautiful? Okay. Just want to get honest opinions. I want, I want to get everybody's... Uh, like I said, some people, a lot of people... A lot of people that I talk to privately said they don't like it. Maybe they're saying it because I'm, only, I'm on camera, too. What do you think of the monument? You like it? Dislike it? Yeah. Oh, it's cool. I like it. You like it? Okay, cool. That's a hard statue. It's a hard statue? Is it a statue or a monument? What, what, what yeah, do you, are, we, are we calling this a monument or a statue? Uh, statue. A statue? It's a monumental statue. Monumental statue. That's helpful. Monument or a statue? Should we call this a monument or a statue? I like monument. Monument? Okay. So we're calling it a monument then. I like it monument. And I, I bet it looks really cool lit up at night because they have all these little, uh, little LED lights around the bottom. Oh, little cool. LED lights. I bet at night it looks amazing. We're going to have to check that out. You got to check that out. Get that yes, out. yes, sir. I, would defi I definitely will. I if you don't know, um, I'll let you guys know now. A lot of people from the uh, minority community, or particularly the black community, found it to be kind of disgraceful and disrespectful for this to be put in re representation of Martin Luther King without having an actual head to the body. And a lot of people told me if you deface a statue, the first thing you do is you take off the head. So that's what... You know, you got a bunch of, uh, and if you're looking at it from one angle, um, I don't know which angle you look at. Maybe the uh, angle where the hands are, that'd probably be the only angle that you would probably get the true meaning of the statue or monument. You have to be right here. And that that right there could be a symbol of an embracement right there. But without knowing, physically knowing that or someone being told what that is, they have no idea what that is at all. Um, like I said, this is this is the embrace statue. It's supposed to signify Coretta Scott King and Martin Luther King Jr. embracing after he uh, knew he won the Nobel Peace Prize. What do you think about it? Good, bad? You like it? What does that symbolize? What does that symbolize? Love. Love? Yeah. We were just talking about yeah. it. We think it's yeah. pretty cool. Pretty cool? Yeah. Okay, cool. Awesome. Yeah. They did a good job. All right. Now, Details awesome. Details awesome. All right, thank you. Everything about it. Thank you. All right. I gotta get. I get. I gotta get everybody's opinion. Everyone's opinion, right? Yeah. yeah. See what they yeah. if they like it, dislike it. Right. Get it to the right people and let them know what people. What are people saying? Well, a lot of people that I spoke to off camera, they, they don't like it. Really? Because they 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 saying it gives like certain images of, of sexual favors and. That's what we came to see, and I don't. Well, you have to be on that side over I, there to I, see we that. Looked. I but guess you can see what it's, you. It's how you manipulate the camera too. Exactly. But it, but if you look on that. Said it. I mean, we just that's why we came, like everybody. Came yeah. Why well, came that here? Because I seen I seen both. Both see, views. Both views. Right. 
The only right. thing I said as, as a black person, I, I could say this. Right, you, yeah. I know other people can't really say it. Right. But I, I'm going to say it because what do you think? if I want to represent Martin Luther King in any shape or form, I want a picture of his face. We That's what we were saying. To, to be yeah. no, because the, the right average right. person looking at that doesn't know what that is. He has no idea. I said, why couldn't he have added the head on yeah. both sides? That's all it was. They put a head up there. Or, right. That's all you had to do. Yeah, the head yeah. with the rest of the body would have been fine. <laughs> Yeah. Right. So I, I don't want to. I don't want. I don't want to turn no one's opinion exactly. away from what they believe in. They believe. But I believe that's what I believe in. Well, you know it because of the picture. But if you didn't know what the picture was, you wouldn't know what that was. Exactly. And every other statue speaks for itself. Yeah. If I look at Paul Revere. He's on the horse. Exactly. They know what that means. Right. I, I agree. Right. Someone who came from another state or another country looks at this. He's gonna be like, what is that? I'm not black, and I could say that too. Hey, you gotta be honest. Right. <laughs> but I'm going around. And, I still like it, though. I do. I, I, you still could like art, uh, but disagree with it at the same time. Right. Yeah, no, I think I, we right from Jump Street. I said, why they? Why when we saw it that night they opened it on the news? I remember that. Yeah. Why? Why didn't they put a head on there? They should have put a head on there. That's all they had to do. Make it simple. A, a head, a head speaks for itself. Nice talking to you, my man. I don't want to curb no one's opinion. I want people to have their honest opinion. But when I give them my opinion, then they um. But it speaks for itself. Like you guys leave the comments. Like this part here could be the embrace symbol. Like, and it all depends on how the camera is. The pictures are manipulated because I see some pictures taken from a certain area where it does look kind of not not the greatest. I could get some uh, minority in input. As a as a minority person, how, what do you think about it? You like it? Now, if you did not know what it was, would you know what it is? Yeah, you can see it. I think it's just based on... So if, if no one told you what it was, you know exactly what that is? You can see the arms the How would you know those are arms on the Martin Luther King? That's what I'm saying. Oh, um, well, that's a different question. Right. How would I know it's arms of Martin Luther King? No, I wouldn't know that. But I can tell that it's hugging. Okay, well, I want your honest opinion. See, me, when I first saw it, because no one told me what it was, uh -huh. when I saw it, I'm like, well, what is it? Uh -huh. Because I couldn't def I couldn't relate to what it was. Now, people saying, oh, that's the, her bracelet, that's her finger. But yeah. unless I personally knew who they were, uh -huh. I couldn't identify those hands. I don't think you could either. Not to that degree. Right. But I, I thought your question was, how do you know what it was? Some people can't really see it because there's no head to it. Right, and that's the, that's a valid that's point not. too. If they put a head to it, everybody does. My see, Martin Luther King is he's worldwide known throughout the whole world. If you put a, a head of Martin Luther King on it, it defines it all by itself. Yeah. There's no no explanation any further. It's going to speak right. for itself. Absolutely. But I, I just curious, get an independent opinion yeah. about it. You know, I want people to be honest. Don't, yeah. don't, don't change it. Just, you like it, you like it. I love it. You love it. That's a good. All right, there you go. I don't want. I don't want to change no one's opinion on how they feel about it. I want them. So, what do you think about the statue? What do, you, what do you think about it? I like it. Yeah, I think it's beautiful. You like it's it? It's really nice. I just think. I appreciate what they did. I think it's just, I think probably the heads and the faces are needed. I agree. Uh, I'm not going to, you know, I want people to be honest. Don't, don't hold back because if you hold back, you're not being truthful. But, no, I do like it. Yeah. Okay, yeah. If you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. See, me personally, I think it should be a head to the body. I, agree. I think you, it's just because, I think from different angles, it looks... I just, with the head, it would align with you better to get the message. Right. Because at different angles, it doesn't look like a hug. I think that's the problem. I think it's like... If there were but there's heads, no body to it. There's no exactly, torso. Exactly, yeah. Like, yeah. With that, because it's just arms, and other than that, it just looks like... I don't know. <laughs> I, I, the sentiment is there. I can definitely feel it. It's just... Well, I, I, I put this way. Maybe the idea was there, but then the thought wasn't thought through thoroughly. Because if, if they really wanted to have a true meaning of Martin Luther King... How about having a picture of his head and his body up there? That's true. Yeah. That's what I, I mean. Think. Every other statue that I see has a body and yeah. a head. Because this mm -hmm. could be almost anybody. It could be anybody. Yeah. And that was actually another young lady. How does she know it's Martin Luther King? And she said she wouldn't. So the statue should speak for itself. I agree. It should be self-explanatory. I should have to tell you what it is and yeah. why it's done that way. What a better picture of an embrace would be two people embracing. 
yeah. Martin Luther King yeah. embracing his wife. Mm-hmm. Right, good, good. Listen to your input. I like to have, I like to have both sides. You know, I like to bring some balance to it. Uh, so I'm gonna kind of walk around this whole. Uh, we're gonna call it a monument because it's not really a statue. We'll call it a monument. Um. Like I said, it all depends on what angle of the camera you, you do get and you do look at it. But you don't actually see a physical body itself. That's the that's the biggest problem. What do you think of that? You like it or dislike it or what do you think? No comment? You like it? Hey, no, no, just be honest. Be honest. You can say you, you can say you well. You can say what you want to say. But freedom of speech. I, I always exercise. What do you think of the uh, monument? You like it? You don't like it? Oh no, we like it. You like we it? Just, uh, tried to Google which uh, like at which event this was taken picture. Oh, that's, oh, that's based off of him receiving the Nobel Peace Prize. Yeah. That's what I thought. So that was back in 1964, I think, when he he um him him and his wife uh, got the message they would receive the Nobel Peace Prize. Mm-hmm. That's supposed to be the hug that they did when they received the Nobel Peace Prize. Yeah, I saw the image yeah. for the um, the image is, I think the image is going to show, like the front no, it's going to show the upper body, like maybe, well, it depends on what image you're looking at. Most of it's going to show the upper body and them two hugging each other. Mm-hmm. Um, too bad they don't have an image yet over here. Yeah. It'd be nice if they put an image of it right here, right? So people can know what they're taking yeah, a picture of. Because if I haven't seen the picture, I wouldn't even have known well, that this is exactly. supposed to be it. No way, you're right. Where is the picture of that? They should they should have put the picture on here. <laughs> Valid point. I like that. Uh, so th- that's what it's supposed to be. When he received the Nobel Peace Prize, him and his wife hugging. Because no, no one ever really said that. So it, it, there you go. You're welcome. You seem like a smart individual. What do you think about this uh, statue? You like it? Dislike it? What? Do you like this? Yeah. Yeah. I think it's a good, a good. Uh, okay, cool. Just want to hear everybody's opinion. If they like it, dislike it, you know. Be honest. You, you don't have to hold back. It's amazing. Cool. Thank you, sir. Thanks for the input. Peace. All right. What do you think? It's beautiful. It's beautiful. So cool that from this direction it's a heart. It's a heart. Yeah. And the details of the hands on it, wow, it's really great. Okay, cool. Do you like it? I like it, but I think it could have been more defiant than to represent Martin Luther King. Like, yeah. if, they, if they wanted to define him better, they put a head in a full body. Like, if I want to represent you hugging somebody, how about a picture of you hugging somebody? Exactly, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> but then you cannot make, like, you know, the heart and yeah. stuff, so. See, my thing is, most statues that I see speak for themselves. I don't, I don't need an autobiography to speak for the statue. True, you're right. <laughs> but that's just be me, me being honest. Let me get out you guys' way, let you guys take pictures. I'm going to take a walk through the inside of that in a second. What do you think? You like it? Dislike it? Think it's good? Could have been better? I think it's Be honest. All right. Always be honest. I say this way. It just means so much in that embrace. It's uh, so symbolic mm-hmm. of the love uh, between the two. And yeah. The fact that he did be seen in the world. Mm hmm. All right. I love it. Well, I like this. Artwork, because you, you can't never, you never, you never discredit artwork, no. but you could, you could discredit the meaning of the artwork. Now, my opinion, I'm only saying my opinion, not saying that, but I, I think it should have been a head to represent him better, because people who don't know Martin Luther King or don't know what this represents will look at that as just seeing two hands and embrace each other, which is good. But if you want to really define Martin Luther King, define him as we know him with a head on his body. It just goes to show that it's not his wisdom in his head, 
mm -hmm. but also in his hands. I mean, that's where the hands are shown as well. So I think it's the uh, no, it's it's like, entire body. The, you, or you think that represents the entire body? Uh, well. No, just say what you say. Don't hold, <laughs> don't hold back. Just say what you got to say. <laughs> don't, don't hold it. You were saying what he had in his head uh -huh. is, is what uh, should be added to here. But it's more than what's in his head and what he's thinking and what he has said and done. Mm -hmm. it's, it also is displayed in his hands. Okay, in his hands. And his body. Mm -hmm. The entire body. What gotcha. we see today is, is his hands, his elbows, his arms. Mm -hmm. um, but it's, it's, a, it's a body. It's a body. It should impress the, the entire Ooh. world. I, I, want in the, I don't want you to feel like you have to say something, you know. No, I'm, feel, I'm feel, telling feel, you. Yeah, I like what you're I, saying. I've heard what other people have said. I heard what they said, too, and I, I heard both sides. I, I, I met people who liked it and people who don't like it. So, I mean, it's mixed feelings on both sides of it. But the good thing is people are talking about it. They are talking about it. They, they are talking about it. Well, they, well it's, it's brought up, I don't know how to put this. If it wasn't too much controversy, it wouldn't be talked about. But because it is controversial, now people are talking about it. If it was a statue of him hugging his wife, it probably wouldn't be too controversial. Maybe somebody might not like it, but it won't be so many people not liking it. I mean, I, people can like just like anything. You know what I mean? So it all depends on you know. I can't change what people think and how they feel. I only could document what I hear. All right, nice talking to you. All right, take care now. I'm gonna take a walk through the middle of it so people can see how it looks on the inside. Okay, where do we stand? I know we got all this stuff. Now, what do you think about it? Um, just be honest. I think it's better up close. Do you mind if I just it's better up close? Oh, the picture is this one. It's better when you're close. It's better when you put it on. Where do we stand? Well, I, I think it's not that they don't like it. They like the, the, the images that. The image that they see on social media. It doesn't give it justice. It doesn't give it, yeah. So I feel like it's just, it's, it's more beautiful. So my, my whole thing. We're just continuing to go on. See, yeah, it's way better. I don't dislike artwork. So artwork is artwork. My thing is I just like the representation of it because it didn't represent Miles as the King. So if they had a head to the body and, and two people hugging, then it's self-explanatory. I mean, they need to have Right. This. That's yeah, another thing. Here. And I was looking yeah, for that. I don't see that. Yeah, they don't see yeah. I don't see that. I think that. some people need to have it spelled out. Yeah, I don't well, understand it either. I see, cool. most I statues, though, you don't I have to define what they are. Yeah. If I put a statue of, of um, Statue of Liberty, for example, I don't need a plaque to identify the Statue of Liberty. It's the Statue of Liberty. Or Paul Revere. You know what Paul Revere is, Paul Revere. Yeah. But when we put a statue with no body and, and no head, then you're like, okay. It raises the question, what is it? Well, I think it's it's the meaning. That yeah. Right. Like but now, if they wanted to define it, they should have put a picture of him and his wife embracing each other. Right. And then they could see, well, this is what they're doing. So now they got now they got to put a picture of them to embrace each other out here. I think it's spectacular. No, artwork is, you can't denounce artwork, because artwork is what it is. It's beautiful. I love the detail. And I think the sentiment behind it is... And then on top of that, the picture is, like on social media, so you don't see the detail. Right. You don't get to see the full image of what it is. Yeah, like all that. You don't get that on the... And then there... It's that side of that. So stay away from that side. Don't don't go on that side. I'll stick to the side right here if I can. So this is the side that really shows the embrace. So if you're only looking at it from this angle, that, that's that's the embrace, him wrapping around his wife. <laughs> we'll walk through the inside there. Yeah. Take a walk through the inside of it and come out the other side. You can see the details of the buttons. Large buttons. There is a lot of details.
She said it doesn't look like a hand. What, what does it look like? You don't know? Be honest, what do you think it is? An arch. Oh, she said, what she said, arch? Oh, arch. Like an arch, okay, arch. Gotcha. All right. All right, guys, I think I come down here and document what I see. Some people like it, some people don't like it. Mixed opinions. I think they could have did a better job on putting a head to the um, actual, actual sculpture itself. It's hard to even Thank understand like, what, how the body parts are interacting with this stuff on the other side. No, <laughs> <laughs> so he's just not taking, taking a video. Or the, um, it'd be nice if it had a body to it. It wouldn't hurt, right? I never seen a I never seen a person without a body before. Have you? Well, it doesn't really give a good meaning why that's like that. How do you explain the two shoulders touching each other, like the way they? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Correction that she wasn't struck by a car, struck by a pedestrian. Guess on the bike. Alright, guys. Some people like it, some people don't like it. Some people say it's nice, it's artwork. No. You guys tell me what you think. And I look for the comments after I um, post this video. What do you What do you think about it? You like it? Dislike it? Be honest. You don't, have to... you don't like it. She's being honest. Hey, be honest. Like, like a lot of people don't want to be honest. Like me. One thing about me, I, I, I want people to express how they feel. Don't don't let me change how you feel about something. Yeah. I think it's beautiful. I really don't me? like it. Me? I don't like it, no. You don't like it? No. Uh -huh. like it. See, people start saying they don't like it when I say I don't like it. I, I'm a, uh, uh, right. See, I'm an independent person, and, and I don't let nobody change how I, I feel. the idea is weird. The, well, I it tell you. Makes no, but same thing you said, like, the Martin Luther, like, where's his face? Right. Like, I think that the thought was a good intention, don't get me wrong. But I think that the outcome of it didn't make the outcome they were expecting. They, they, they wanted something to say embrace with him and his wife, but they should have put a picture of him and his wife embracing. Yeah. I mean, that's what, how I feel. See that? The face. Or even just like a side face. Something, something to say. Because you want people world, because he's known worldwide. Yeah. Um, if you want people from all over the world to come see him and recognize who he is and what he is, mm -hmm. how about recognize him by the picture that we I know, know him by? Yeah, I heard her too. Yeah. yeah. It's a woman's bracelet, not like <laughs> you know what I mean. Not, right. Not the reddest bracelet. It's a woman's. <laughs> a woman's bracelet. bracelet. So that could be any woman. Know, well, that's when you said that. It's one Martin Luther King Jr. And look, like, I only know because it's on social media and all that stuff like that. So right. I to see it. Exactly. Like, people just walking by, like, Don't know what it is. I'm not going to understand what it is. I agree. If they would have did that, that would have made more explanation of what he represents. And, yeah. Right. So I, I, I go around, I want... I want People's honest opinion. I want people to say. A lot of people that paid for that event, they said they loved it because they didn't want to. They didn't want to talk talk about it. But me, I'm going to be like, if I pay for it or not, I'm going to tell you how I feel. You know. I mean, what? Remember, we have a. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> what is it? See, see, that's, that's what I need to hear. More people being honest about how they feel, like. I think they could have put a head to the body. And also put a picture of them two embracing out here somewhere. Unless they put a, 
Uh -uh. Y'all take care. I'm just going to go over and ask more questions on how people feel about it. <laughs> Honest opinion counts. Nice. Good nail bed. All right, guys. So, uh, quite a few people gather around to see this. Uh, we're gonna call it a monument because we, we we don't want to call it an actual statue. There's stuff on the ground there, but you have to really read it to understand what it says. I'm gonna see if I can document that while I'm here too, so people know. These are probably the artists that were involved doing it. Uh, there's quite a few of them, so I'm gonna try to get as much as I can. I'm not so sure what these names represent. You like it? You just like it? What do you think about it? I'm not too sure. Who, who, do you know what these names represent by any chance? I do. So they're, are you talking to me? Yes, ma'am. Okay. They're local Boston activists that were involved in MLK's movement in Boston at the time. Oh, okay. Cool. Thank you. Yeah. I appreciate that. Oh, okay. In my mind, what I see is like... Local activists that were involved in his movement at that time. Oh, he's like... I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna try to, to actually move over like two, two inches. Thanks. Go Byron. All right. Jeep Jones, huh? All right, Doctor Jeep Jones. Doctor Emma Lewis. A lot, of, a lot of names. I might not get them all, so. Shirley Owen Hicks. Very well known person. Senator William Bill Owens. Senior. Now I'm gonna have to move around. Let's see if I can move around this and get on the other side here. This one's facing the opposite way, so I gotta kinda. Gene McGuire, Kenneth Guscott of the Guscott family. Am I going to be in your way? Oops, sorry. Let's get an image of him posing. <laughs> Thank you.
So I think I got, I think I got them all. Well, hope maybe not. Sarah and Shaw. Uh, I do remember Sarah and Sarah and Shaw. I think, well, I think no, there's more to go. Hold on. Alright guys, I think we're just about at the end of uh, all the labels. I think it's like maybe six more to go. That one's blank, so they're going to probably put something in the future. That's a blank one. But maybe they missed that all together, who knows. Alright guys, I just want to show you a little bit what's going on down here at the uh, Embrace statue. Well, I keep calling it a statue. I don't know if we call it a statue or a monument. I heard it's like 24 feet tall. And somebody said it weighs like 40 tons. I don't know if that's the actual number on it or not. I know it costs $10 million to, um, to, to allegedly to build. Or, I don't know if it's that much they put into it or they, how much they paid off to have it built. I don't know. That's, that's, that's the embrace. That's the embrace right there. That's the real embrace. Yeah. <laughs> it's the embrace in front of the embrace. That's the embrace in front of the embrace. There you go. They go, hey, Sean again. Now, now we're in black and white. Sean, Sean Sweeney. On, yes. get, 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 oh, let me get out of Sean's way. Here you go. <laughs> now, you, you guys don't know, this is on my second YouTube video now. Sean Sweeney, I know about Sean Sweeney about 15 years now. Good it's man. He's going up by the hour. He's going up by the hour. <laughs> so, Sean's a local... Uh, photographer in the Boston area and he has a, a website called Flickr, correct? Well, it's my stuff is on Flickr. On Flickr. Oh, what's that? Hold on. Pretty girl here last week in the snow. Cool. All right. And then you can see it in the oh, snow. Oh, there, in the snow. See that? Yeah. Sean's a very well... Well, he is. You are well Take known. Take a lot of pictures to get a couple of good ones. But you are well known, though, too. You know that. Well, a lot of people know. I'm a know. legend in my own mind. <laughs> oh, just, so if you, if you guys ever go on Flickr, Flickr.com, you find some pictures of me on there as well. He got a lot of pictures of me on there. Come on, give me an eye. I give you, I give you a smile. Hold on. <laughs> and he does it. He's been doing this for how, how many years? You've been doing this a long time. So Sean Sweeney has a website called Flickr. Well, he posts his. He's on Flickr. He, he, po he posts his. Yeah. Video uh, pictures on Flickr, let me yep. say. You don't own it, but you post them on Flickr. Let me correct myself. That's right. I, I don't want to say the wrong thing. Got to give you the. Put the link in the sub. In the I'm sub. gonna see if I can put the, the link in. I, I don't put a lot of subs in it. But I'm gonna try to put that in this one. So that people can right. find you on Flickr. Yes, and, uh, you're gonna make me famous. I I'm gonna it. make you famous. He's just, Sean's a well-known guy. He's gonna be after this video. He's gonna be well-known. Yeah, let's hope so. So Sean Sweeney. Yes, he's a well-known guy too. <laughs> <laughs> think I'm that much well known? Maybe I don't know. You're gonna be. I'm going to be, but a lot of people do know who I am too. So it's the, 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 the feel is mutual. Well, I hear you. 
It's it's good. Good. Mutual fame. Mutual f There you go. There you go. This is the Yeah. Artwork, you never you never could say bad thing about artwork. Cause artwork is, it, it's it's how you present artwork is what you want it to be. I mean, th there is good and bad artwork, but I guess it's how you define it too. I mean, it's right all. Right where I'm standing, that's beautiful. This is the image that they they wanted to show. This this is the, this is the actual image of the embrace right here. Yeah. The other sides don't really represent the embrace. Well, if they help you remember it. Right. Here you go. Really? Yeah, I'm I kinda like I, I, I I'm kinda like you on steroids. So I do what you do, but I do it in the, on the video form. And I document a lot of stuff I see like I seen the pictures you you've done. You have some good real good pictures. So I, maybe one day we'll team up together. <laughs> we'll team up. I got your number, I I will contact you. I keep I keep I keep in contact with you, Sean. Good seeing you. All right, so Sean Sweeney is a very well-known, well, the reason I say well-known, a lot of people do know who he is, some people don't know who he is, but, you know, being well-known doesn't mean everybody knows who you are, just a lot of people do, do know who you are. And um, I came down here to document the, uh, the Embrace statue. Uh, everybody has mixed opinions, which is fine. I wanted to get the unbiased opinions about it, and I've pretty much got both sides of it. Now I'm going to head up out of here, off to my next assignment. But before I leave, I want to get a picture of this right here with their reading over here in the corner. I don't know what this says, but at least I want to see what it says. Be out of your way in a second. Um, no, no, hurry. I'm reading. No problem. Hopefully, you guys can read all that. What do you think of it? You like it? Just like it? It's interesting. Cool. All right. I'm headed out of here. Everybody's coming to look at it and check it out. All right, guys. I'll catch you on the next one.